Some athletes decide to measure their personal power rating using apparatus shown. In the table below list the three quantities they must measure in order to calculate one man's power and the instrument they would use for each measurement. Measuring personal power is discussed before in many questions. It's a common idea of questions here. Your power equals the work you can do divided by the time you take for this work. Any work equals force times distance. That's why your power will be the force times the distance divided by the time you take for this work to be done. This is one way to find your power. Here the force is the weight of the load you are lifting. Distance here is the height you will lift the load to. Time is the time taken to lift this load one time. Of course, you can repeat and take the average. So, the quantities need to be measured here is the weight of the load, the height, and the time. The instrument used for the weight is the Newton meter. Height is used the measuring tape. Time is using the stopwatch. Let's see what the mark scheme gives the marks for. Three marks for the question. For the first quantity saying weight, or load, or force. For the instrument, balance scale. You can say Newton meter, or spring balance, or force meter. This is one mark. Saying distance or height. You can say tape measure, or you can say meter rule. This is the second mark. For the third mark, you can say time, using watch clock or timer. These are the three marks of the question.